much. Anyways, woo! Woo, 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 woo! The classic buttery jack. I got the Swiss and bacon buttery jack. Buttery jack, buttery jack. Got to try buttery jack. Buttery jack, buttery jack. Gotta try buttery jack. It's gonna be good, I hope. Anyways, you guys are doing great. Hey, I got, this is the new uh, Buttery Jack from Jack in the Box. This is, uh, I wasn't gonna get the classic, but you know what? I love bacon and Swiss. So I got the bacon and Swiss Buttery Jack. Uh, it's a quarter pound patty, melted garlic herb butter. Uh, brrr, this has Swiss, not provolone. This has Swiss and on a gourmet bun. So yeah. A gourmet bun. So, Jack in the Box is doing it again. This is a new signature beef patty with garlic herb butter. It was in the bag and I could smell the garlic herb butter even before I took it out of the bag. And here's the bag right here. I just want to show you. I'm not lying. So the combo, I got the combo. Came with fries, obviously. And um, seven bucks and change. So, you know. You know, it's like seven and change. But I'm really excited to try this new Buttery Jack, because who doesn't like butter? Pass the butter. Oh, Roland Brando. Pass the butter. Anyways, um, so yes, so we're gonna give this a shot. A shot, yeah. So here we go, gang. This is what it looks like. Let me take it out of the wrapper. And look at this. This is the artisan, or the new uh, gourmet bun. And in French, it's gourmet. <laughs> So this is what it looks like, the gourmet bun. And let's see what it's happening here. So look at this, you got the, I was gonna say pico de gallo. <laughs> Bacon, uh, Swiss, and this garlic herb butter smells so good. It smells so garlicky and buttery. Who doesn't love butter? I love butter. I love buttercream. I love butter on my popcorn. I love butter on my toast. I like butter, no, it's too much. I'm rambling, why am I rambling? Anyways, if you like butter on something, put it in the comment section below. There's other places to put butter, but you know, this we're keeping this PG. Anyways, so yeah, so this is what, smells beautiful, I hope this is good. This is the new Swiss and Bacon Butter Rejack, everyone. Buttery Jack. Let's give this a shot. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. I have to eat on this side of my mouth because I need a root canal. So the tooth's really tender, so I gotta like make sure I gotta eat on the other side. That's why I'm kind of like. Wow. First off, I'm, I get this butter flavor in my mouth, the garlic. And look at this quarter pound patty. Isn't that nice? It's not some little janky little patty. It's a quarter pounder. Let me try this with the bacon. Let me try to get some more bacon on this. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. I'm chewing funny because my tooth hurts. Okay. Wow. The flavor, the garlic, herb, butter really swings on this. And when you couple that with the new bun they have, the new gourmet bun, it's really good. Um. The bacon, you know, bacon's bacon. Can't go wrong with bacon. And especially the quarter pounder patty here, which swings. It's better than those little janky uh, normal ones you get. This is a pretty good sandwich. Um, um, it's too bad they weren't, you know, more, you know, like the picture and the advertising looks like a beautiful sandwich. But it's just, you know, your basic looking burgers you can see. Let me give it one more shot here. Mm-hmm. Mm. 
doing this. Mm-hmm. Okay. My tooth's killing me. <laughs> I go in next week to the dentist. Okay. So I got the flavor. Now, the quarter pounder was a little, to be honest with you, I think it was a little overcooked. So it was a little dry. But, you know, they threw in that garlic herb butter, which kind of made up for the dryness. So it kind of coats your mouth with the, you know, the buttery, silky a smoothness. Uh, the bacon, really thin. Um, the I really like the new gourmet bun. It's really good. That's flavorful. It's soft. So the garlic herb butter is really the kick, the key to this hamburger. Because if not, it, if we didn't have the garlic herb butter and the new bun, it would just be some janky old burger. But being that Jack in the Box is going out of the way to try new stuff, I think this burger. On a scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this, and my you got my honest opinion here. You know, I wish they could add more. If they would have added more garlicky herb butter, and maybe could it? Maybe I'm thinking. I don't know. I, mean, I don't know if they should have added some lettuce to this. I don't know. The Swiss is a non. The Swiss cheese didn't make a difference at all. Can't even taste it. It's all about the garlic butter. So, on a scale of one to ten. I'm giving this, uh, I'm giving this Jack's buttery Swiss and bacon um, a nice solid seven. It would have got an eight, but it's a little dry. So this is getting a seven, gang. Um, I wanted to give it higher points. So next time, I'm going to try the classic one. And maybe that's better. But today, this is the Swiss and bacon. It's getting a seven. It's a little dry. And um, the bun's kind of, it's good, but it's kind of flat. But, you know, that's what I got. So I'm giving this a seven. That's just my opinion. Get to Jack in the Box and try it. Try the classic or the bacon Swiss and see what you think, gang. Anyways, leave comment sections below what, what you like to do with butter and what you like to put it on, okay? <laughs> Anyways, if I made you hungry today, uh, please subscribe, become a part of my food gang. Check out my Facebook, check out all my twits and twittiers and thingy majiggies like that. You guys are the best. Um, this is Joey from Joey's World Tour. I give you all a big hug. This channel's growing because of you. Please tell one friend about my channel. And that's it. And stay tuned for more fun stuff from Joey's World Tour. Thank you all for tuning in. This is Joe for Joey's Super Cool Food Reviews saying peace.